Hi, I'm Sonia from Dance Like an Egyptian and today we are going to talk about rib slides and chest circles and neck slides. Okay, so to do a rib slide, remember posture is important. So bottom tucked under, shoulders roll back, head up. Okay, and what we're going to do is, so we don't want to move our hips at all. So normally, you know, when people dance, they move their hips. Belly dance is all about isolation. So to do a rib slide, the movement is actually from here, so from your ribs, the muscles in between your ribs here. Okay, what we're going to do is just put our hands to our hips, just so that we know we're not moving our hips. And then what you want to do is, you want to just slide. So you want to look like this. So slide, 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 slide. This is a rib slide. So nothing's happening below my ribs. Nothing's happening above my ribs. It's actually purely my ribs sliding from side to side like so. What I like to do sometimes in class is that I might get the girls to just try on one side first. I might, might get them to go for eight, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So they get used to the movement and then maybe to the other side. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, before combining it and going one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Now, rib slides are good by themselves, but you can also use a rib slide to then do a chest circle. So with a chest circle, we need to have that rib slide, but we also need to have this action as if someone's pushing you here. You wanna go, so move, move your chest back. So you wanna be pigeon chest for a moment. And then again, the other side, as if someone's pushing you in the middle of your back, you're going to go forward. Okay, so back and forward, back and forward. So to combine that, we rib slide first to the right, right, back, left, forward, right, back, left, forward, right, back, left, forward, right, back, left, forward. We can do it the other way too, so left, back, right, forward, left, back, right, forward, left, back, right, forward, left, back, right, forward. Now this move, you can't do it from the back really, it just doesn't, you can't really see anything from the back. So you'd do it front on or you might do it to the side. So if I was doing it to the side and putting it all together, it might look like this. And then I might have my hand here, hand on my hip. I might have my hand to the side. But it's quite quite a nice move. I might have my hand up. But it's, it's 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 a small move that's just up, you know, sort of here in this area. Okay. Um, then moving on to next slides, which is the same kind of feel. So usually when I get people to start doing this, I might get them to put their hands here on their shoulders or hands here. That way they know that they're not moving their shoulders, it's just your neck that's moving. So again, you just want to go slide, 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 slide. slide. So sometimes it helps to have hands here, slide, the same. Slide, 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 slide. So again, I'm kind of, I guess I'm kind of doing the, this movement. Forward, back, forward, back, forward, back. And I'm kind of doing it to the side side, side, that kind of looks like that. Now you can frame that so you can bring your hands up so then you can go slide, 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 slide. What I can do too with my hands is I can, I'm probably very flexible, I can bend my hands right back so I think it looks right, rather nice to do this and then slide, 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 slide. Because then you're framing yourself. It looks nice if you frame the move. So again, here, slide, 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 slide. That's the same as the rib slide. Similar. Slide, 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 slide. All I'm doing is the movement. I'm not moving my hips. I'm not moving anything above my rib cage. It's purely happening here. So I'm just sliding, which it does take a little while to master. I know when girls come to my class at the beginning they always have a bit of trouble doing this one, but they pick it up. So anyway, so that's how you do 
rib slides and how you can incorporate then rib slides to do chest circles and then if you can do rib slides eventually you'll be able to also master your neck, neck slides as well. So again here it's just my neck that's moving, nothing else. So anyway, that's all from me. Thanks for watching and uh, I'll see you next time. Thank you. Bye.